Hello, 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 and welcome back, everybody, to a new series. You must be wondering, where the hell am I? Because there's no way Ollie made this much progress on his Minecraft series. That's for goddamn sure. I didn't. <laughs> but today, we are working on a new series which I'm doing with a friend, because I have friends. Uh, so, this is a collaboration with the, the lovely Rimmel, Ready Made Lobotomy. I will link her maybe now, bam. Or alternatively, if I can't do that, which I think I can't, uh, she'll uh, a link to her channel will be in the description. But anyway, what this challenge is, you his, and look at the amount of chests and stuff. There's so many chests here because me and Rimmel aim to gather a full double chest of everything, most, most items, everything, most items, uh, we will gather everything, most items, in a double chest, so, oh god, candles are new, yeah, uh, so that's the plan, but what makes this interesting is I live in England, Rimmel lives in the Americas, we're in different continents, so any progress that we need to convey to each other, very difficult. So I'm calling this uh, the Cross Continental Challenge. Uh, that's what we're naming it. Um, the name may change, but I liked the name, the Cross Continental Challenge. Uh, so we need to just start because Rimmel's actually been already grinding. If I show you quickly, she built all of this in creative, bear in mind, uh, just because we thought it'd be good to have like a good starting base. So she's finished the granite chest, started diorite, no smooth stone. Christ, the woman's a machine, I tell you. She really is just grinding away on all of this stuff. Uh, I wonder if, and it's a big if, I actually have no idea where I am. What's this one? It's empty. Hmm. Me thinks. Oh, there are some things that are just missed. Okay, fair. Uh, we both have our own bedrooms. This is this is Rimmel's room. She's got things are cooking. Oh, look at her go, honestly. She's absolutely grinding like a machine. I will steal a little bit of that just so we have some food because I've noticed I'm hungry. Uh, so, yeah, there may be a little bit of lag for me on this server. It's not the worst. Um, we could immediately jump to... Well, what we're doing today is not necessary for that. We're going to take this from, from Rimmel and... We have to set up some farms. So, because Rimmel's going to be doing a lot of the, the heavy grind, I'm going to be doing a lot of the, the farmy farm stuff. So we need to gather things pretty quick. We need to gather loads of eggs so we can start grinding eggs off of our list. So I'm going to look and see if there's any chickens around here real quick. Uh, we need to also... Oh, that's some zombie flesh. There's some more. We also need to get... I know she's wrangled some cows. There's some honey over there, so there'll be bees. That's good. Uh, let's have a look. I know she said she, she wrangled some cows, but if I'm honest, I don't see them. So, in my mind, they don't exist. Uh, so, yeah, we're, we're basically... We're kind of starting again, but really not, because... Rimmel's blitzing through half of this challenge without me, so I thought I'd jump on and get going with this. So we're going to be doing this in part with my Let's Play. It's going to give me some more time in between the Let's Play episodes, just to make some of that steady progress that kind of needs to happen. Uh, this server is also hosted in the Americas, so... My... I think... Yep, there we go. My interwebs is, is, a, is a struggle a little bit. Uh, it's doing its best, to be fair. I think eventually what we may do is we may private host this. I don't know where might be better, but there might be a, a country more in between where we can private host and just be a bit more efficient. We also need to be breaking grass, actually, for seeds. That's one thing we need to start doing, because we're going to need a lot of seeds. All the seeds... We're getting none. Wow. It's either the drop rates or my lag is just... Oh, it could be the lag. Yeah, see? I was going to say, we definitely should have got some seeds. Uh, there we go. We'll work with this for now. It's not the worst. It's it's livable. Um, we just need to... I think it's because also I'm still... For me, all of this terrain is loading in for the first time. 
so we do need to take that into consideration but hopefully it'll get better and better uh if not as we said like there's definitely the option to possibly move on to some private hosting in maybe greenland is i guess greenland or iceland greenland isn't it i think it is the island in between the americas and the uk the wonderful place of greenland uh, so we should probably just set ourselves up here by this water. I think it's a fairly reasonable spot to set up for a second. Uh, we're going to make a crafting bench. It may look like I'm struggling, and I, I, I blame it all on lag, and that's everything. Okay. Uh, we don't technically need to be completely starting from scratch, but I feel like I should a little bit. So we're just going to quickly get ourselves sorted with a little bit of cobble just so that we have the the basics down so that we're not relying purely on Rimmel's heavy grind to carry us through this play there we go see get some stone we only need a little bit I'm gonna try and get what three for a pickaxe and then a shovel and I will need a hoe so I think that's enough lovely because we're going to convert this little area into, so, pickaxe, that, that, right? Da -da. Boom. Okay, cool. So we don't need this anymore. We do need this. We need that, and we'll need that. Lovely, okay. So we're going to quickly just, like, flatten a load of this terrain. So, yeah, so the point of this challenge is to kind of do a lot of grinding. And I, if you can't see where this is going... It's going in the direction of, I'm going to be streaming this a lot. Because there's a lot that will need to get covered. A lot of ground that needs to be sort of made. Like, some of these farms... Oh my god. Hello, the rubber band is real. Oh, the rubber band. If, if you are allergic to rubber bands, look away now. Um, the grind is going to be real on this. So, it's very much not the sort of let's play where I can just sort of chill and be like, Oh yeah, completely fine. I don't want to do that. I want to do that. There we go. Yeah, that's fine. I don't want to do that. I want to do that. There we go. Um, it's not the sort of let's play where I can be very like, oh yeah, don't worry about it. We'll do this in a bit. We'll do that in a bit because like there's a lot to do. Like you, this warehouse is huge. We haven't even explored half of it because I just wanted to get going, you know. Uh, so we're going to go one, two, three, four. Okay, we need to go another three this way just so we have our little lip as well. Uh, so yeah, so there's a lot to get done on this. Uh, I want to get the farms going real quick so we can start producing stuff. I also need to be doing, I think, more of the redstone because I think Rimmel would rather I do that just because she's not a, a fan of the old redstone-y, which is fair. Uh, one, two, three, four. Then one, two, three, four. There we go. And then, yeah, so that would be normally one, two, three, four, but that's fine because then we're going to go, uh, yeah, okay. Uh, so we're going to go one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Yeah, cool. And then if we break this and then we break this, that'll allow us to do this. This is a, a homebrewed farm that I'm making up on the spot, but I'm okay with it. It's going to have a, a couple good, like, infinite water sources, and we'll have some wheat growing quite a large amount, and it will all stay very hydrated as far as I'm aware. If not, we need iron for buckets so that we can um, solve that problem pretty quick. Oh, it's getting dark. We do have a bed, though, in our side of the warehouse, so we may have to flee back to that bed. If that is the case, yeah, I think it is the case. Let's just clear this last bit real quick. And flee. Flee. We can't actually use this gate. I need to talk to Rimmel because, see, I thought it let me in for a second. I got really excited. <laughs> There's a donkey over there. Maybe we can uh, start to do some donkey stuff. So I'm actually just straight across here in this blue zone, which I'm very happy with because blue is one of my favorite colors. Ollie's house. Yay. And we've got all the blue. What's through here? Oh. <laughs> Yay. And we've got a nice blue bed. So it's perfect. So we can go to sleep. Oh yeah. So I was, this looks really bad on me 
but I was actually trying to uh, see if I was opt to see if that was maybe the issue with that um, gate over there. I'm not trying to L cheat. A. I'm just trying to play a game, but it's fine. We made it out. As long as one gate works, I don't need both. Just greedy having both gates, isn't it? Uh, we also need to sugarcane farm, don't we? And cactus, okay. So we're going to work on that grind real fast now. So one, two, three, four. There we go. So that's to there. So then this can go out another... Uh, so we need to do four blocks out this way. Is that four? One, two, three, four. Yeah, okay, cool. Trying to make just a real big farm that we can start just chucking any foods and vegetables in. Oh, I actually saw that Rimmel had carrots, didn't she? We can go and steal that and plant those carrots because they're one thing that we will have to grind and we can at least put in one half of this farm and we'll get loads of resources out of this real quick for the amount of um, just the sheer amount of space that we've got, if I'm honest. Like, it's not a small farm by any means. Look at it. Ginormous. And we should be able to hoe pretty much the entirety of it. Not with this hoe, though. I think it will run out before then. Yeah, we can just go all the way along here. And then it's one, two, three, four. Yeah, cool. And, like, yeah, I mean, look at it. It's huge. As long as it all stays hydrated, that's the main thing we're after. We're not really looking for... I mean, it could be probably more space efficient, but... I mean, come on. We ain't about efficiency here. We're about just pure strength. Uh, one, two, three, four. Go all the way along here. There we go. And look at it. Hydrate. So good. And we'll have a nice little board around the edge as well, which will just mean that, like, jumping down into... See, told you, wasn't going to do it on that one. Uh, we need just a little bit more, but we've got enough cobble to do it, so that's fine. Uh, just to get all of this done, it's a huge farm, and we will basically half it down the middle here, and we will do, do that, there we go. Uh, we'll go get those carrots now, start planting those up, and basically we'll fill this farm real quick. What we need to do in the meantime, because, you know, I'm kind of trying to treat this a little bit speedrunny-ish, like, I want to be, I don't want to be dawdling. How did this drop here? Oh, uh, Rimmel did say it might not be lit up fully, so keep your eyes peeled, guys. If you see any danger, boys. Hello? Oh, no. Oh, there we go. Uh, carrots. Sugar cane. Oh no, she's she cooked them all. Oh, that's that's very sad if she has cooked them all. So we had potatoes. I think there's a village nearby, uh, but that's fine. Uh, oh, some some eggs. We can use the eggs for the stuff. That's fine. Anything else we can raid from here while we're raiding Rimmel? You know what, let's just. Don't tell her. Shh. Keep it on the hush. Uh, and that. This is all ours now. For the farms. Okay. So we will need a. We're going to use some of that iron anyway for a bucket, because oh yeah, we can't go this way. Can we? E MLG. Um, because we want to be able to get the farms going for sort of everything. So let's just also. Plant these carrots. Perfect. Okay, carrots planted. There's another wheat seed there. Sure, we can... I mean, sure, we can just... There we go. Just for the sake of duplicating our carrots a little bit more. There we go. Um, so now we need to start harvesting the other bits as well. Stuff like sugarcane we're going to need a lot of, and we're just going to need seeds, so, I mean, no harm in doing this, I'm just running through just to basically see if we can find that village that's nearby, um, and we need cactus as well, and a lot of sand comes with the idea of cactus, ugh, this is a lot, it's a lot that my brain's having to take in, um, and we're running out of food, 
It's fine though, we're building a farm, right guys? Do we have to farm rabbits? How do you farm a rabbit? How do you farm this little guy? Uh, okay, so, big desert, big, big desert. It's fine. Let's just start getting ourselves some cactus as well. Because we're going to need all the dyes at some point for the countless amounts of wool. So we're going to need a lot of sheep, which is fine. We're just going to, for now, I think, the best solution that I can do for the cactus is, in fact, break it all down like that, grab it all, and then just... We won't do anything extra with the cactus yet, just because, I mean, it's it's such a... Oh god, we're going to lose so many. It's fine. Okay, they'll just grow back. Um, I'm just more curious to get uh, at least some infrastructure started on that, so that we can have a large amount of it when we go in to actually um, look at that structure generate in the distance. It's insane. Uh, so yeah, so we can have a large amount of that just to get started with. We're going to need to make our bucket and actually just start getting going with our sugar cane as well. I just wanted to see if I could see that village, you know. I've sort of said to Rimmel, we're going to try and, I think, avoid talking about this too much off of, like, uh, like out of this. So, like, I kind of want us to communicate a little bit maybe through signs and stuff so that it makes it more of that, like, ooh, we don't live near each other, so it's difficult to talk sort of challenge rather than it being oh, I thought it was the top of a house uh, rather than it being very much just like hey yeah by the way I did this uh, I'd rather it be a bit more like hey there's a sign in your room that says Ollie found X in X and you can use it to do Y rather than yeah just like texting her being like hey I, I found the nether fortress and it's it's really cool and I did a thing and I did a thing I'd rather her find out through signs here so we're gonna make a load of signs at the end of this episode and relay a load of information of what we did which is mostly nothing right now uh, we set up a farm but like not successfully I don't think we need to set up the sugar cane um, I just thought you know sh I mean she has told me there was a village uh, and that's because she went exploring and that's how I think she got the carrots and potatoes. We're going to need another farm for basically the same farm, but for potatoes and beetroots. Um, I'm just getting a lay of the land here a little bit as well. Um, because, again, potatoes will need lots of, beetroots will need lots of. Uh, I'm going to see if I can start the egg with the four eggs I've got here. I'm going to see if we can... Oh, lovely, more sugar cane. I'm going to see if we can basically put a chicken, at least one, above a hopper and just get eggs going to start with. Because I'll make two chicken farms, basically. I'll make one that just, like, solidly produces eggs. And I'll make another that's automated to produce the the chicken drops. So feathers, cooked chicken, etc. Rather than having it all integrated into one because you can't really do it integrated. Well, you probably can, but I can't do it integrated into one, so... I'm going to need that separate two different devices. And I'm just going to... So there's a sheep and there's pigs. Don't see any cows, which is concerning. Because maybe I misread what she said. And instead of, hey, I, I rounded up some cows, she meant, hey, I slaughtered all of them. Because <laughs> that's going to be a real, real issue. Oh, more eggs. This will help. This will help greatly. Uh, more sheep, more chickens. Okay, so the sheep and sheep, chickens and pigs shouldn't be the biggest issue because it looks like we've got a lot around and I can live with that. I'm gonna struggle with cows currently unless she's hidden them. But I don't know why she would have done other than just to really trip me out a little bit. Um... Okay, but we've got a good lay of the land here. It's quite a nice area. Basically, the behind the house is where all of the animals live. And this is where we're going to have to come to start rounding things up. Things like chickens I don't need to round up, but I will need to bring a lot of... Hello? These are mine. Go. These are mine. These are mine. I think we're, uh, we're experiencing a little bit of... Ah. 
a little bit of lag. <laughs> okay, something fell. That was us. There we go. Loading in. Oh, it's becoming the night time. We've got eight eggs. Okay. Um, there's some more there. And let's go back to the warehouse where it's safe. So we're going to have to come back and get the sheep, but that's fine. Because the sheep shouldn't be too hard to traverse across the land. The thing we're going to struggle with is the pigs. So we need radishes for the pigs. So I need to find that, um, that village that she's found. And hope that one of them has radishes in. Because I don't think they follow anything else anymore. I think their tracking is purely radish based. So that's a bit annoying. Um, but that's fine. We can we can overcome that. We need to tomorrow when we sleep and wake up. We need to plant the sugar cane uh, and get that going. Try and maybe make a, a little hopper for the chickens, just so we can get the chickens going as well. And then yeah, I think we're we're getting some good progress here. Oh, there's a skelly boy. No sir. Not uh not while I'm lagging. Will I be in combat? I don't think. Oh, God. Do we have to get a double chest of these? I found one. And these I'm struggling. This I can do now. I'm the Trident Master. Christ, though. That's a lot of stuff, isn't it? That is a lot of stuff. To, uh, to track down and do. There are some things that we've spoken about. And I imagine maybe these are going to be one of them. Where we've said instead of getting 64, 64, 64, we're going to get... One 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 and just fill it with ones rather than sixty fours because I feel like filling that chest with sixty four <gasps> He found a dupe. Oh no. Huh. Oh okay. Right. It's happening. Combat Yes. Who is the monster tamer now? Tamer? Hunter. Many Endermans. We won't fight them, that's for goddamn sure. <gasps> don't look, don't force me to look at you, you absolute hooligan. Um, so this is our wheat side. We'll just keep planting some more of this. Get all of our wheat going nicely. Perfect. We'll use that bone on the carrots again. Uh, one, two, three. Beautiful. Eight more carrots. I mean, we're just like... The carrots are one of those things that, like, they multiply so quickly that I don't mind putting the bone meal onto the carrots. Because seeds I can get just by... Oh, there you go. One. It's not so hard to get seeds. Uh, let's now make ourselves a little chest with a, a thingy. How do we make a barrel? What's, what goes into a barrel? Okay. I just think a barrel looks a little bit more aesthetic here. Uh, sure, we'll make three barrels, and we'll put we'll put one here. We'll put one. Can I can I do it here? Lovely, cool. And then we're gonna put one over here, where we do the. Let's do it in line, actually. Come on, let's. Try and be a little bit more reasonable with what we're doing here. And let's do... We need another... Another shovel real quick. Okay, so if this is in line here... Let's just go like this. Just so we've got a little bit more... Uh, put it like that. Oh, put it like that. Then this and go bam 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 oh yeah we're gonna keep one in front <laughs> what are we gonna do let the chickens out like that ridiculous uh so then we'll go one more up and then what we'll do is this just while i throw the eggs there's 10 eggs we should get at least one chicken right there you go it's technically all we need two would be better Yes, okay, two is fine, because we can breed them once they grow up. Would have been nice to have got that rare uh, triple chicken, but that's fine. Uh, so then we can come down here. We can also cut away this part of it. 
just so it looks a little bit better for now. And what we can do, if we really want to improve the looks of this, and it's something I tend to do when I build something like this, is grab these. Oh, look at that honey, it's full. We're definitely going to be using that bee and making some good old fashioned honey. Uh, what I tend to do is something like this. If I just get a load of this real quick. So a nice simple little thing, but like it improves that and just makes it a little bit nicer rather than how it looks right now, which is maybe a little bit um, rudimentary. So I'm going to do one here, one here, one. Oh, I broke the axe, didn't I? Yeah. Uh, one here, one here, then one. Oh, this is going to be really annoying. Should have done these top ones first. It's going to prove to be a little bit more of a nuisance. One here. Okay, look. I'm going to be real here with you guys. This is annoying. What if I just go, what if I, what if I do this? All right, I, I come over here. I do this, I do this, I do this, I make the axe. I then bring the axe and I break and then I do that. What the? Okay. No problem. We'll just, I really thought I could do it like that. This is so annoying right now. Okay, right, one more. Cool. And then you go and you remove just these little bits here. Okay, yeah. And you come over here and you make a little, uh, is it this way? Right? Yeah, 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 cool. We need a little bit more. Uh, this is not how I normally do it, but I'm kind of experimenting here a little bit because I feel like this could look all right. If I was smart, I would have made that into a stair, but now I can't, so. Um, I would have made all of these into stairs. And you know what I need to do? Yeah, that's what I need to do. I was like, it looks weird right now because it was a little bit janky, but it's okay now. Wait, this, right? We just did it, okay, cool. Um, do this, do this. Looks a little bit more like it's holding itself up now. Um, and that'll be our, our chicken eggs. And we can just, maybe just do it like a little bit like this, just so it's not too restrictive. There we go, and that looks a little bit better. We could do with some coal, if there's any down here. Real quick, just a little bit of coal, just to make some torches. There's a zombie villager somewhere here. There's a big cave, in fact, because I can hear it with my eyes and my ears. Uh, come on, there's a villager dying somewhere. Is that way, but down, I think. Something bad is happening over here. Can we find it? Using our ears? I'm normally pretty good at this. Let's see. Oh, it's like right in front of us. Oh, it's like right here. Down. Really can't find this. Where is it? This way. But then he's. It's like right here. He's there everywhere. Is it above? It's gonna be real bad if someone drops down on me. No, but cold. So we ignore everything else and we take exactly what we came here for. Just ignore the danger sounds everybody and we've hit level one hey what what milestones we're hitting these guys are real scaring me though 
We could do with the bone boys back there, though. Their bones are delicious. What we could do is actually with a, a spawner somewhere nearby. That would help us immensely with uh, some of these goals. Skelly spawner, of course, would help with farms. Zombie spawner, I think we can trade rotten flesh for emeralds. So that would be kind of helpful uh, later on for gathering a lot more resources with just trading. Um, but we'll see what we can do. For now, we're going to go and light up our... And just ignore all of this. We're going to go light up our little area up here. There's definitely danger down there, though. Um, but that's fine. We don't need to worry about danger. That's Rimmel's job. For now, we just worry about making sure that our farms are running smoothly. Which they are so far. I don't have a single issue with the farms. Uh, I don't think anyone could have an issue with such farms. There we go, there we go, there we go, and there we go. That's all the torches down. Got some more carrots, there we go. Beautiful. And look at this operation go. We could try, and I mean it's so risky, but we could try and see if we can find where these boys are. There was a little cave entrance, like, over here, right? Somewhere here. It's not a cave, it is just a tiny hole. That's fine. Uh, so, we need to also plant the, um, the sugar cane now. So, let's go back to sleep real quick. Is there a way we can, like, hop over here? Like, oh, I'm such a genius. Look at those blocks despawn. Yeah, I still made it through. This is where it slings me back outside to death world. Lovely. So we're going to plant that sugar cane, and I think that's where we're going to call the first episode of the Continental Collection Challenge. Continental Collection Challenge. CCC! Triple C. That's what this is called now. Triple C. Ah, oh, what we need is actually... Wait. There we go. Oh, we're losing those blocks, admittedly. Wait. Oh, no, we're not. Cool. Uh, we need a bucket just so we can make a load of infinite water. But that shouldn't be hard to source. Nobody watch. There we go. Um... Yeah, so we're going to literally make ourselves some imp uh, a sugar cane sort of area, just so we can start to grind now, because we've got 29 on us now, um, and then we should be good from there. What I'll probably end up doing, you know, is actually, uh, for now, just putting it back here, so that we can grow it close to everything else and not be too annoyed about having distance in between. This one, this one's going to be the easiest one to automate, and I'll automate it as soon as I go mining a little bit for some redstone and stuff. But for now, we'll just take it up to here so that we can do this. Lovely. Then we go and dig down one. Just a very simple sugarcane farm. Yep. It's all looking good over here on the farms. Oh, we need to sort out those zombies, though, badly. Maybe that's what we leave a sign for Rimmel about. Hey, there's bad guys under my farm. Can you find them and kill them? Yeah, do you know what? We're going to leave the signs as well. We have to leave some signs for Rimmel to be able to read. Because that is literally the point of this. Okay. Uh, there we go. And then all the way down this side. Pretty much pretty good there, I think. Um, probably could do more, but for now I think I'm pretty happy with that. We'll get everything harvested slowly. We now need to make our signs for Rimmel. Well, let's just do all of this. Then do one, two, and then we'll make six signs, and we'll go and stick these in her room. 
uh, and we need to do it. We need her to do a couple things for us. First off, find uh, and kill the bad guys that live under the farm. Okay. It needs to be somewhere obvious. So I think right. This is a good board. I think. Uh, there we go. Rimmels. <laughs> To do list one. Ah uh, no, let's do one. Kill the bad. Ki Kill the baddies under the farm. This is probably a negative one. Find the baddies. <laughs> uh, baddies. And the uh, farm. And then two is give uh, two. Where is the Village. Village. Also, uh, there was one other thing I wanted to say. So it was find the baddies under the... F f kill the baddies under the farm. Find the baddies under the farm. Where is the village? Um, and... What was it? What was the other thing? Oh my god, look at these. I actually got some goodies. Um, what was the other thing? We've got the farm set up going. Um, oh, we should plant those before we leave. Uh, don't know. It's fine. This will do for now. Uh, kill the baddies, find the baddies, where's the village? And then next episode, what we'll do is we'll go ahead and we'll basically use what we found, so the village and stuff, to go and get the last bits of crops, so potatoes and... Um, well, potatoes and radishes, but we will also need, um, we will also need watermelons and pumpkins at some point, but for now that's fine. Um, I'll just break all of this. Oh, um, I need to tell her, but I will tell her this on, off camera because it's more of an off camera thing. I need to get fixed so I can open that gate. Uh, but anyway, perfect. I hope you all enjoy and have a wonderful day. I hope you enjoy this series. It should be going for a long time because, Christ, it's going to take us ages to um, get all of these drops in just, like, large quantities. So we'll call it here for today and have a fabulous evening or day or time in today. Give it a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.